Hello everyone, this is Advait Taco from XJ Developers and today in this video I will be showing you how to get a GCM server key or sender ID and even API key from Google Developer Console. So let's get started. So to get a GCM server key and API key, so we'll go to google.com and then type the Google Developer Console. And then uh, you will be redirected here so simply click on Google API console I will be including this URL in my description so you can directly visit there uh, in this Google developer console uh, I have already made uh, many projects so it will be coming there so you can see this project it is directly opening any of the project so don't look at that if you are a new user so the, you will get this message only select a project so now click on this and there you will get option create a project so click on create a project and then type your project name suppose I will be typing here YouTube tutorial as this is as, it, as this is a tutorial so I will type that so this is the project ID okay then create it uh, it will take a few seconds to create so let's wait till it creates a project okay so now our project has been created and now the step comes to enable google cloud messaging to get our api key so click on this google cloud messaging and you can see a enable button so you can uh, you, you have to click on this button so it will be enabled So now it is enabling it. So now uh, to get API key or uh, to get API enabled, we have to go to credentials. Go to credentials here. okay uh, so first of all uh, in this option which api you are using so keep it uh, google cloud messaging if you are making or, or if you are making for other users uh, it could be any anything so you can select a other api it's upon you so i am choosing google cloud messaging as in the next tutorial i will be showing you by this project id and this api key only that how to make an app with push bots with full SDK integration so here also I will select web server and then this button what credentials do I need after clicking here uh, the name of the key so I will keep it server key 1 and in IP address just remember don't put any IP address here uh, it should be uh, totally blank and then click on create API key so we have got our API key so this is our API key and this is our so here you will get the information i will again show you by clicking here and then going to project information so this is the project number this project number and this api key will be used for making the push notification app by push works so remember it and I will again recall all this information in my next tutorial of how to make an app with pushbots with GCM service. So thank you guys for watching my video. Please like my video and subscribe my channel. If you have any doubt about this method or any of the step, 
सो प्लीज़ कमेंट बिलो